We're here with Dr. Samuel Stoop of Northwestern University and the winner of this year's Von Hippel Award. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you very much. I am very proud uh, to have received uh, this award. Deeply honored. I admire greatly who got it in the past. And so I'm extremely pleased and flattered. So tell us a little bit about your research and how it's applicable to the world. Well, I'm interested in soft materials. And uh, back in the 1990s, uh, I was working on polymers. At the time, I felt that uh, in order to really revolutionize soft materials for technologies at large, you really needed to go beyond traditional polymers. And this is where the concept of supramolecular materials came from. Basically, uh, that means that you create materials with molecules, yes, of course, but uh, you don't stop at making molecules. You go further and you design molecules to interact with each other in specific ways by non-covalent bonds. So what that does is it makes materials that are much more dynamic than the normal soft matter. This happens to be a great opportunity uh, for biomaterials used in regenerative medicine. We have discovered very recently that um, we can tune their motions within the material. And tuning those motions allows materials to talk to cells more effectively. By focusing on the ability of materials to signal cells through their motions, uh, we discovered that an unprecedented level of reversal in paralysis after severe trauma was possible. Basically, what we observed is that when motions were tuned to be a, at a certain level, then uh, the, the severe injury that caused paralysis basically um, transformed into um, the growth of uh, or the regeneration of tissues in the spinal cord, which is very difficult to achieve. In other words, the, the, the animal regained mm -hmm. function and was able to walk normally after being fully paralyzed. So this is very mm -hmm. exciting yeah. to observe that it was a soft material, uh, a self-assembling soft mm -hmm. material that is injected as a liquid then becomes a soft structure in the spinal cord that was able to do that. And, and that basically uh, is something that we will be able to use in, in the brain as well to address stroke and brain injury and neurodegenerative diseases to create new um, therapies. And so having uh, soft materials that can actually uh, restore function in the brain and in the spinal cord is a huge thing. And it is all rooted in designing them molecularly and supramolecularly, meaning that you design them uh, to interact with each other, the mm, molecules right. in a certain way, therefore move a certain way, therefore signal cells effectively. And Dr. Samuel Stoop, you're on the cutting edge of this and the recipient of this year's Von Hippel Award. And we thank you so much for talking and sharing all this knowledge with us as thank well. Thank you for inviting me to the interview.